Hey y'all, welcome back to Everyday Mama. I'm Leanne, and today I'm going to share with you 14 ways to spread love on Valentine's Day and every day. This video is a collab with my son Wyatt from his channel, World of Wyatt. His video shows you how to make one of the ideas I have for spreading love, his bag of hope. Wyatt has lots of how-to videos along with magnets, science lessons, and fun moments over on his channel. Make sure you subscribe when you're there. I'll put a link in the description box below. Now on to the 14 ways to spread love. Seven of these are in your home and seven in your community. The first one in your home I call compliment hearts. You simply post a note on their door that compliments them every day leading up to Valentine's Day. The next one in your home I call scriptures of God's love. Sharing these scriptures as a family is a great way to get to know the true character of God and uplift your family's spirits all at the same time. You can write these verses out or you can just verbally tell each other at devotional time or around the kitchen table. A third way to spread love in your home is to pray for and with your family members. This will not only bond you more as a unit, but it will put the greatest love of all in the center of your family. A practical way to spread love in your home is to do a chore for someone you love. My husband has gone to the grocery store for me for the past year because he knows I absolutely hate going. That is love. A fun way to spread love in your home is to hide a love note for your spouse to find. It can be a long poem or a simple I love you. It's the thought that counts that will brighten their day. Once, my husband hid a note for me in my glove. It was an awesome find one cold morning. Another way to spread love in your home is to randomly celebrate one of the members of your family. Grab a special plate and cook all of their favorite food for that evening. Gush over them over dinner, compliment them, let them know how much you love them. Make it a big shindig just for them. My last idea for how to spread love in your home is to take your pet on a surprise walk or hide a treat for them to find. Our furry family members give us so much love every single day. They deserve for us to give them a treat or two and show them how much we love them. Now for the seven ways to spread love in your community. My first idea is to thank a company that provides you a service. You can write them a thank you card, compliment them by calling them, or when they come over, have a special treat waiting on them. They are people too, and a thank you goes a long way. Another way to spread love in your community is to send flowers to someone who lives alone. Bringing some life and color into a home is such a thoughtful way to bring love into your community. A practical way to spread love in your community is to pay for someone's meal or drink. You can pay it forward by paying someone behind you in line or just asking a friend to dinner who might need a pick-me-up. A heartfelt way to spread love in your community is to visit the elderly. My son Wyatt and I have visited retirement homes, and assisted living facilities for the past four years, once a month. It has truly been a huge blessing in our lives. I think we get just as much love back as we give. I highly recommend this way of spreading love. A fun way to spread love in your community is to send an anonymous gift. Find those underappreciated people in your community that do so much and send them something to brighten their day. It's easy and fun, and with Amazon Prom and all the other online stores, it's really simple to do. 
Another way to spread love in your community is to donate food and towels to pet rescue organizations in your town. What a great way to declutter your linen closet and help these little fur babies feel more comfortable as they're waiting on their forever home. If you don't have any towels or food to donate, you can always donate straight to the organizations in your town. Two that we give to are Hero Dog Rescue and Best Friends Animal Society. I will put the links to both in the description box below if you would like to give. Last, but definitely not least, is my favorite way to spread love in your community, through creating and giving a bag of hope. This is where Wyatt comes in. Head on over to his channel and find out the heartwarming story of why he made this bag of hope and what he puts in it. The link to his video is in the description box below. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has encouraged you to spread love in your home and in your community on Valentine's Day and every day. Until next time, wishing you lots of simplicity, progress, and joy. Now let's go spread some love. Bye.